the grudge match on the field, but also in the stands. The two crowd favorites forced to duel it out in a match that decides one half of the grand finals. This crowd has been into it all pregame. And they're already getting started here. Oh, Renault. Right part of the box saved immediately by Zed. Looking shaky on the goal line, but there's still some space for Team Vitality. And if history repeats itself, this is going to be a long series. Certainly going the distance off the backboard to Exotic. We're already given crazy fast action, Torby. Early pressure for K-Corp. They work that Vitality back line. Vitality haven't found a way out in the first 30 seconds. Army Corp can keep the pressure up. Here comes Alpha on the sidewall. Not going to go for a low 50 50 and still bounces high. Redosin behind the ball, booming clear. Tempted pump there from Alpha. Unsuccessful. Taxi trying to fish that ball back over to Exotic. Army Corp struggling to get that ball back, but a big 50 from Exotic. It's going to come down to these transitions for the blue wall. They started out right on the kickoff with some good pressure. Into the corner for Zen, looking for a demo. A lot of pressure from both teams. Vitality fans behind us. I know will their team into this net, but Army Corp won't let them through. Redosin, a nice catch. Got the dead. In front of the net! Save! Of course! Of course it's gonna be Zen to clean up! Off that flip reset, Team Vitality starting us off with a bang. A lot of defense to start, but one push out, one open for Radosin is all it takes. And this is so similar to that matchup against Falcons. Radosin came through the first goal for Team Vitality. Was a flip reset, but hold on a minute. Alpha just bumped his own teammate. It's looking catastrophic on the goal. Zen next up on the ball. Sonic to force him into one dimension. Army Corp back on offense. A lot of shots earlier. Now looking for a way in. Itachi denied. Off the backboard. Matira. The slow 50 50. Blue wall immediately trying to handle some pressure. The first goal falls in favor of Vitality. What response do we get from KC? Free ball here for Redosa. Little bit of space. Taken away again. Itachi getting in the front of the rotation. Got some space. Sonic's there though. Puts it straight down. Vitality. Little loose, a pop up, Redos in a full tank. What's he got here? One reset, denied again. Here comes Casey, denied again. 10, good 50 50 in the midfield. Team Vitality starting to starve out all of K Corp. Patience here from Patira. Got the bump as well. Tachi, follow up, not forthcoming. Zen gets in the middle of it. Breaks down that K Corp rotation. Redos off the ceiling. Got through one. Enough. Oh, 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 oh. Jumped a little early enough. He's on the K-Corp got the ball back, Itachi has Alpha flying into him, trying to prevent them from moving back downfield with Itachi. Non touch from him, another pop up here for Zen. Got the reset, looking for the bump, he's got him, saved! Itachi has to carry it out by himself. Here comes the three players of KC. Game one, as fast as we expected, across the pitch, looking for Vatira, but he opts to go for that rotation back. Vatira, a little bit of space, has to bring it back down, Zen punches it away. K-Corp rotation continues here on offense. It's tense in the half of Team Vitality. Oh. K-Corp, they missed their chance on the counterattack. Surely the second one will go in their favor. Zen trying to find a way out. There is none right now. Army Corp still looking for that first goal. But Dostin forced back a little bit. Some hurry up plays on defense for Vitality. They're just getting back to it in time. But Dostin gets there. They're surviving for now, but Army Corp keep hunting. Atachi on the dribble. Underneath, Zen won't let him. This ball has been stuck in the corner of Team Vitality for what feels like minutes. The pressure not folding for Team Vitality. Zen off the ceiling, gets the challenge win, and that's relieving all the pressure. A massive win there. And Vitality, a demo, the shot right into Exotic, but a free ball, a shot up. Oh, what a save, rebound, denied immediately. Army Corp won't let him in. And this is where the opening was created. Army Corp were able to get that counterattack. Unfortunately, execution is not looking clean, but for Zen, it's looking flawless. Oh, Alpha just flies past one. Looking for two, didn't find it. And there's Carmine Corp 
trying to get out on defense. Vitality hanging on to that lead. Let's see if they start to play a bit past it. Final 25 seconds. Ten alone in the corner. He's gonna waste time. Try to bully out Vatira. Oh! Does it by oh! himself and sets up Alpha, but immediately blocked. They gotta get downfield now. Hitachi on the slow dribble. Slips right by Radosa, but gets away from the ball. Vitality clear right back to the blue. Zen gets through another. Just saved off the bar. Radosa and save again. This is not where K Corp need to be at the end of game one. Zen towards the net. Still in the air. Army Corp looking for it. Exotic. Nothing. Still. Will it touch the ground? Or are K Corp going to find a miracle here? It's been popped up. Radosa. Nice ball. of smacks to the ground. And K Corp can't recover. Team Vitality. Game one victory. Trump's sound off. The Vitality fans elated about that game one victory. Tight. It started so good for K Corp. All of that pressure. Zen forced to make a couple of crucial saves. Everybody on Vitality getting involved on defense. And then K Corp got stuffed for the rest of the game. And there's a reason why Vitality in this tournament so far, Jorby, have let in the least amount of goals. Their 50-50s, their execution when it comes to the small things, like making sure communication on point, 50-50s, those challenge games, they don't waver in tight situations. <laughs> Vitality, they could do no wrong in that corner. There was one opportunity, one chance for Casey to get into it, and they choked. You saw that Radosin bounce when they did get that goal. And man, oh man, is this crowd nuts. Ooh. Look at them. <laughs> Just listen to them real quick. And There's also a whole bunch of nuts over there yeah. rooting for a car On the other side, KC going equally crazy. It is so loud in this venue. And the players can absolutely feel that effect. Game number two about to get started. And just kidding. Oh, How about we wait a little bit longer? Out a little bit. Oh, they don't like that. Oh, uh, they don't like that indeed, but you know, sometimes you gotta extend the time a bit, build that pressure, Zorby. And game two, it's up in the air for KC. This is a rematch from the spring major. Back then it was Team Vitality who took the win in seven. Army Corp looking to rewrite that script and rewrite history. Thinking about the two star players on these squads, Matira and Zen. A lot of people have picked Zen as the best player in the world. Matira not. How can got a not? bit of a chip on his shoulder about that. Ooh. And this entire weekend, he's been out there trying to prove to everybody why he's still in the conversation, oh, yeah. why you should still be looking at him. But this is tough, and it's a team game. It's, it's Talk about that play from Radosu, setting up his team, that getting is that reset. Making it hard for It's Kate crazy because that's the exact same way they started out against Team Falcons. It was Radosa and Flip reset, and he has had a lot of people calling for his head, especially after recent performances, people pointing fingers at him, but he has responded at this World Championship. He's soaring out there on the pitch, but on the other side, you mentioned Batira against Gen G. He was unstoppable. Six goals on eight shots, followed by four assists. That man was unleashed. And he wants to follow it up against Vitality. Army Corp, if they can get those quicker follow-ups, they weren't able to pressure Vitality after the first half of game number one. And they flip the script here on Forbidden Temple. Game number two. It's all up to KC at this moment to go blow for blow, exchange a punch with Vitality. Last game, Itachi was at the front of the rotation. He was creating a couple of opportunities. And they were just met with immediate clears by Vitality. Here, they're already pushed back. Tira forced the ball out to the left. Nice play from Zen. Good 50. And those challenges that have continued. The possession for Verdosa backing up, putting it in reverse. Exotic. Nice carry out. And drop down. Oh, Zen looking for the bump! Just avoiding him, Vatira gets the save, and a good follow-up from Itachi, but more defense for K-Corp. Full boost for Vatira, which means, of course, the 50-50 should be effortless. It's not that easy as Vitality stuffing them in their own corner. Itachi, not a lot of boost here, but he's got a good landing. Good pass to Vatira. He's got the boost, and the reset were taken away. Here come Vitality, Zen behind the ball. He wants to get that boost. It's all about building something consistent. A foundation in the opponent's half and waiting for a mistake, but then gets bumped, and here comes Exotic. Does it take long for K Corp to get on the board? Exotic finding a way through, thanks to Itachi 
be playing Headhunter. Whoops, then out of the way. Alpha can't get back. And at that point, Itachi had to sacrifice an arm and a limb, but it was well worth it. You get in Zen's way, block his path to the ball, and say hello to your first goal. Vitality win a perfect kickoff. Immediately challenged. Good response from K-Corp. Get a couple of consecutive touches, though. Rados steals up. the ball. Zen's so fast, can't quite get it across. That's where the speed comes in handy for Team Vitality. But there's also speed on the other side. Zen beaten out again with a 50. The midfield domination from Vitality is here. Tashi looking for a clear. Zen doesn't get a follow-up touch. Army Corp gonna play more defense. Zen, a little bit of boost, got the hook. One, but it's taken away. Alpha was hunting really closely. This is another counterattack opportunity. Army Corp have done this all throughout game one. Still thinking back to that missed opportunity. They want to repeat it. Find a way to punish. Bait in Team Vitality on the offensive side. Dosen looking for a way in. Exotic's not gonna let him find one. A chance to look here for Exotic. Not a lot of boost. Tashi able to pick up a canister. Army Corp refueled in the midfield. Atachi on the catch, but taken away. Actually, the there, the shot way too high. Just enough off the bar. It looks like neither team can get too comfortable in the opposition's half. But here, a flip reset solo play in the air. And slowly we're seeing those solo plays come out on both sides. Zen's been going for a couple, but Kira flying high, getting warmed up, and it's only game two. Tashi taking out Rodostin in the midfield. Oh, exotic. Nothing developing there for K Corp. And Alpha sends it right back downfield. Wanted to get a better 50 50. He can't take the boost either. Vatira weaving his way through the defense. Now, Vatira, another one. Just couldn't get anything going. He didn't have boost. Was hoping to just fly it over the defense. Hey, ball just in. It's a grounded approach from Carmine Corp. This is two back to back dribbles. Vatira took it from his own half all the way to the corner. Oh. It placed his right in front of Exotic. And a beautiful flick over the defense. Alpha. Tried to charge him, and Exotic got such a light flick on the back side of where he was trying to challenge it. He thought for sure Alpha was going to get there. The bitch shocked it. Exotic just gets the goal. That's where the 1v1 practice comes out. Dorby Radosin behind the ball. He's a flip, reset, merchant. Alpha 54 from the backboard. Giving his oh. dead. Follow up after follow up. Won't break through. Vitality of the ones forced to respond now. That's the big insurance for K Corp. Pop back out, Exotic. Not a lot of boost. Dosin. Another flip reset. This man, every time he's by the ball, Jorby, he's getting a reset. And he know, he always just goes. That's what's been so difficult for every team that has played Vitality. When you think you finally have space, Rodosin just close lines you, and then he can beat you with mechanics as well. K-Corp, they're the ones in control right now. They're the ones Ooh. dictating the pace, and Vitality can't get back out on defense. Off the post and out. You're right. Come down to any member of Team Vitality, but we have to realize that their matches have been getting that much more difficult. It was a 4-0 against Moist, a 4-1 against SSG, a 4-2 against Falcons. This one, that much more difficult, and they can't even get on the other side. Exotic, big demo on Zen. Big clear as well, but what are they gonna do with it? Atachi, good soft touch for Dosen again, crashing in front, Zen, ball is over. the ball over. He can't find the goal, he can't find the ball! A big whiff, an opportunity, they're still hunting for it, but Vatira, as cautious as can be, he's dribbling through them again. Zen able to get another 50. Rodosu crashing again, Vitality. And they're away in, Rodosu just turns forward, looking for a bump, he's got Vatira locked, but then Exotic clears it out for K-Corp. Another fake from Exotic. Armin, don't look panicked whatsoever, that insurance goal has to be working wonders for them and their mentality. They've stopped on the goal line. They've been dribbling out, not rushing. Clears, 25 to go. Oh, here's another one. Oh, Radostin pump back into the post. Alpha 54! Half the stadium erupts as Zen bumps Radostin <laughs> into the shot, off the post. But my, oh my, are they thankful that Alpha's sitting in the back. He'll take the team pull shot, or the pull pass, I guess. And now 20 seconds for Vitality. Zen, aggressive kickoff, but he couldn't win the 50. Exotic, like double back to Vatira. Almost worked out. radosti has got to be careful. Hit the brakes yet again on the goal line. And this time, Carmine don't have the insurance. They led by two for so long. Does that defense retain that composure? Another one for K Corp on the ground. They win game two. Vitality, not going to give up just yet. Still Alpha up in the air. Zen, Zen so fast to the ball, but he loses to Vatira. Radosti pops it up. Next up is Zen. 
Keeping that ball up on the zero second drill. Atachi kills it. We got a tie game. This is what we expected. The rivalry between the Blue Wall and the Golden Hornets. Back and forth. Carmine steal a game back. They had insurance. They let up a little bit at the end, but ultimately it's not gonna matter. There's almost zero space on the pitch right now, Turtle. Everyone's trying to catch, trying to make a couple of moves. Exotic had that big play, and Exotic, he's been the one collecting those goals. Matira getting top honors with all of those things at the end after Vitality finally put pressure on. Yeah, and this just shows the versatility of Matira in my opinion. I'm looking at this game, it was so defensive from Fati in, uh, by himself on the defense. This man was alone, he'd go for a dribble, had several moments where he could have panicked, lost possession, lost a 50-50, but he held strong. And that is almost impossible against the three-headed dragon that is Vitality. Army and Park will think about their journey here and think about their series against complexity. It started off a little slow. They weren't as willing to challenge the ball. They weren't meeting complexity at the punch. Then after game two, something flipped. And after that, it was lights out for Carmine Corp in their next two series. Their journey here against Vitality. They tied things up quickly. They held Vitality to one in game one. They didn't let them completely pile it on. And now they've taken control. It's important to find flow state as early as possible against the reigning major champs. Team Vitality, it looks a little bit shaky. In that last game, Zen oh. a couple of chances. Itachi slow passed out across oh, the box. Oh. And it's a booming clear down the other side. Matira can't catch up. You got caught too far forward, but you didn't expect the zoom from Zen. Pitch right through the net. And he has redeemed himself. Think back to that previous whiff behind the ball in game number two. To start out game three, getting the first goal, it's a pitch across the field. That's gotta feel good. Also tells you how tough it is to find those passes in this series that you feel the need to jump the route early. And you can't wait for the play to develop because if you do, the ball's gonna be behind you and into your net. Now look, oh. Metonic forward trying to find the puck, but Zen, he reads everybody. No way, Zen! no way. Oh, what a save, which still popped up in the box. Exotic is there in time, again, cutting off Vitality's rotation. But denying. Zen in the air, he dodged the demo in his own half. And was able to air dribble it all the way to the other side. This man has started several plays in front of his box. Carmine Corp on the offensive. Vitality looking for a way out. They all gotta wait for Exotic. Dosen planted on the wall, he's got the first touch. Itachi next catch, quick flip, and he's got that 50. Love this approach from Itachi. On the reset, Itachi! Dosen. No, he what? missed the ball! What? Zero completely whiffed! Did he expect for Dosen to get a touch? It's still a disaster in front of the net, but they get out! Team Vitality still in the lead! Not a lot of boost, Matira. Freezes everybody on Vitality. You saw that little wave dash to chip them, but Vitality still gets the clear. It's over Zen. their head! Whoa. And they it again! Zen! Another touch, but nobody's there for the rotation. Alpha has to play it back to the corner. Nobody can hit the shot. The pressure here for both sides. Wide open opportunities. Two mistakes. Vitality remain in the lead, but here comes Exotic. Can understand the nerves. We've never had a crowd this into both teams. It's truly divided here in the stadium. And all six players have never been in a world championship semi-final matchup. The pressure unlike no other. Both teams with so much to prove. Oh, that's not a good touch. They gotta let their gameplay do it. Scary stuff from Radosin. He's the player who backflipped on the goal line. I think that might have been what caught off oh, 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 oh. Where's the touch? Still finding a way to get the save. How does Matira end up getting a touch anyway? Carmi Corp, though, they can't get the clear. Radosin just sitting downfield. Exotic, no chance at it. Itachi, a soft touch again. Oh, Itachi trying to drill this Carmine Corp team forward with these soft touches. It's muddy on the field, a grueling match for both sides. The defenses have been all over the place, and Batira, that shot not on target, it would have hit the crossbar. Alpha has it covered regardless. Oh, great follow-up, but the shot! There it is! Up! Exotic, able to put the Band-Aid over the wound, finds the angle, hits the shot. Beautiful shot from Exotic. 
a messy game three, but one they finally tie it up on. And after all the mistakes, all the sloppiness from both teams to strike, after all the chaos is over, you've got the momentum. This is Carmi and Corp's game. Hard clear to Zen. Zen with the catch. He's only got three boos. No chance at it. Rebound. Back to Alpha. Too hard of a catch. Atachi takes him out. Radosa next up. But Exotic's planted on the backboard. No one's going to get through. It's a tough corner play. Exotic. Better 50-50s from KC. These guys have been doing it all series long. Back into the midfield. Alpha. Nice read. He's looking for Zen. He's not going to find him. Exotic. He's got the shot. Oh, off the bar. So close. It's been literal centimeters for both of these teams. It's hit off the bar, off the inside of the post, but it keeps bouncing out. Radoskin, the soft touch, and Tachi's just diving Good. forward, trying to force the ball out. Exotic finally gets another touch. Pixels away from both sides on finding the goal that changes up this scoreline. Alpha 54 behind the ball. Need a better 50-50. Vitality have been flat, but in the last 60 seconds, do they come alive? Ten trying to force it out. Shot! Shot from the right side over both goalkeepers. Team Vitality retake the lead. This time he finds the mark perfectly. There's still some time, Jorby. 60 seconds for KC. Tension builds now. Vitality. Do they get some insurance? Ten can't beat it against Exotic. Alpha next up. Against Patira, he wins it once. That touch not gonna do it though. Itachi flings it out to the side. Vitality matching the rotation perfectly. Radosnik blocking the clear out. Does he get another one? No. K Corp running out of time here. Diving the route, but they missed the ball. Radosnik is trying to be a threat. Another booming clear for K Corp. This is the opportunity for KC off that clear. Two players based from Team Vitality. Not the best front touch from Itachi. Wondering what happened there. And they're still on the offensive Ooh. with Kira. He fakes the shot, leaves it for the third man. Whoa. He comes through, but it's saved. Way too weak. Easy for Alpha. Atashi diving from the opposite side. Somehow gets a touch back on net, but Zen takes it all away. Vitality of Hangout hung on to the lead. Zen avoiding a bump, Just avoiding two. Time. time is gone now. k Corp got to do it in the air. Exotic, first touch. Denied. Vitality take the lead in the series. They take a punch back at the blue wall. And it all came down to who could find that shot, the execution. You can't deny the opportunities that were created from both teams. But when it came down to striking, that's where the difference was made for Team Vitality. Too fair, pumping his team up. You see him extremely energetic behind his team's line. And K Corp are taking a timeout, and honestly, after how messy yeah. that game was, I don't blame. Him. I mean, as we look at the Mobile One High Performance replay, it was sloppy. It was grueling on that field. A bit gory there too. 50-50s, physical plays, and to lose a game like that, of course you're going to take a timeout. We get one for Carmine Corp. And if we think all the way back to Jorby. With their previous matchup, these timeouts were crucial. KC able to win their game after the timeout, as well as Team Vitality. I love having drums at this event. It's so good. And the chance is so everything. Good. What an atmosphere. This is by far the craziest crowd that Rocket League has ever seen. And to play in front of that, I mean, how would you even describe the emotions under that play? You can understand why it's been such a mess. All eyes on the prize right there. Everything these teams are playing for. That trophy, that prize, these fans. And I still think that this is going to be another even matchup. And I absolutely expect KC to take back another game. And I think this is going to hit new records for sure. We're underway 
right here in game number four. Both teams are trying to clean up their act a little bit. And Ooh. K4's gonna stop with a big double, but denied by Zen. Exotic. Hello, welcome to game number four. Would have been ridiculous. And the mechanics flowing on the side of KC after taking that timeout. The nerves under control. You had 60 extra seconds to calm down. And it's working out. Slow down for a moment. Patera sizing up this Vitality rotation. Pass off the corner for Vitality. No bump, no bump that time. Looks like there was a little bit of contact. Or this exotic car made it feel. Itaki oh. to the midfield, but Patera's hanging so far back. The second man doesn't want to take the risk. Because Rodosi's sitting there on the wall, and he's gotten that clear every single time. You don't want to overcommit the last time. Remember that pinch from Zen earlier on? Now Batira almost got it out. Granted, Batira couldn't have expected that pinch from the previous game. But still, those little things, they're gonna force you to make different decisions in these tight moments. Renosin coming across. Batira trying to find a way out. There's a good 50 follow up from Ataki. Alpha somehow steals the ball away. If I tell him, oh, on offense, Zen, the oh, speed. Target, get put way too easy for Exotic. Way too easy for Exotic. Perfect position on the goal line. Easier clear, Zen doesn't find the touch. There's been a couple of mechanical issues on the side of Vitality. Might the nerves. The semi-final. This is everything for this oh! team and everything for KC. It's Coxy! Marksman on the net! Perfect shot! And Carmi Corpanzer! It's their turn to take a game off of this series. Start out swinging. Good kick off Batira behind the ball. Redosin. Oh! Not the best 50 50, and it's gonna slot in. On the ground, the low 50. And there he is, the MVP. Bullies his way through the defense. Amazing kickoff. What you needed to see from KC. And here it is again, back into the hands of Batira. These guys, every kick off. Nothing. Team Vitality getting bruised in game number four. We haven't said Zen's name a lot. In some minutes, Turtle, he's been shut down by Carmi Corp in the last couple of minutes. Vitality, a way out again. Can they find it? It feels like we haven't said any of their names in quite some time. Redostin was the main star. For Team Vitality, I'd say to get those first two wins clutch, crucial, and critical in those moments. But how about Itachi? Second man behind the ball. Whoa. And that's a good 50-50. Straight to the other shot side. Kegor don't want to see that kind of pitch again go into the net. This time they oh, get the there strike. There it is. Oh, it's going to be a long climb back out of that 3-0 loss. But this goal might be the start of it. Just like that. 2.36 on the clock, we might be in for a shootout. Out of Vitality, approach the kickoff. They've got a couple of good bucks. This time, neutral. Oh. Great demo to respond. That's the physical play. You're not going to win the 50s. Just try and take out one player. Zen stuffed again. K Corp have been denying him behind the ball. They know the threat is there, and they're sending the full house to stop it. Another demo on the back end, this time from Zen. Zen taking everybody out. Atachi, the last man. Vatir on the spawn, gets the next touch. Vitality got to work a little harder. Even whenever both your teammates get de demoed, Vatira somehow comes up with the touch. This man has stepped up in game number four. Two minutes remaining. Team Vitality got that first goal, but there's two needed. Well, they've done a good job to stabilize for now. They're going to take the space if they can find it. It's come at a premium. Now Alpha shortens up the space real quick. Redosin behind the ball every single time is finding the answer. It's a gritty game, Turtle. Shove your car into the ball. Shove your car into the other team. Force that ball out in front. Push it in the net. 
Vitality aren't giving up. They need one more to tie this up. Two unanswered now. They were down by three. They fought their way back two times. Can they get a third? Oh, Exotic finding Vatira. Vatira on the wave dash, but pop. Zen had him red. Nice play in the midfield. Vitality looking to carry this ball all the way to the other side. Bonatachi takes it away. Rodosman still looking for the edge. Backboard. A little space for Vatira. Zen had the pop up, but Atachi's there again. Rodosman, he gets the pass, but Alpha has to wait. Midfield boost in favor of Vitality. Possession in favor of Vitality. This feels like the third goal. They can't quite find it yet. Atachi keeps getting in the way. Zen coming across. Again, they can't get by the corner. Vitality will crash the corner, find a way across. Alpha trying for the bump, not gonna work. A pass out, maybe no. Huge clear from Carmine Court. They're in the trenches right now. Whoa! What is this? What? Jorby. Unreal! And now K Corp getting started! And it's too expensive for Vitality! They have crumbled in game four. They put in the work to get themselves within one goal. And all of that has now fallen down to the floor. Carmi Corp back with a three goal lead. That quieted things down for Vitality real quick. You thought the momentum was in their favor, and then things just flipped so quickly. And now you're talking about a tied series, except for maybe a potential comeback, maybe a potential match point in the future. Zen ain't giving up, though. Got a 50, but there's nothing there. Think about what's at stake. It's a single elimination playoff bracket. You don't have a second chance. This is your season on the line. Everything you've worked for, it all comes down to staying alive in this semifinal to make it to the Grand Army Corp. The three goal lead is gonna stand, and they bounce back in game number four. Yeah, dude, there was no way that there was gonna be match point three. No, no way. These two teams, two French juggernauts, absolutely not. Batira picking up a hat trick. Then assisting in that you department. You have to call a timeout. You have to call a timeout. Uh, absolutely. I mean, after conceding a goal like that, 100% have to reset. And I'm not getting any call for a timeout, Jordan. Zero. Like, zero offense from Vitality. Only three shots on net in that game. That's not going to get it done. Bumps out the physical game, working to perfection for K-Corp in that game. But Dolson tried his best to get them back in it. And then the own goal, we're not going to see a picture. It's already seen there. But then kept it under 200 points. Carmi Corp have shut him down. And this feels worse than a game where you just get obliterated the entire five minutes to get within one, Jorby. To smell victory. To get a taste of at least tying up that game and then to fall short because of your own mistake and not even an opportunity that was created by KC. We're not getting a timeout. Vitality, they don't care about what happened. Get right back into this game. Farah has decided, we play on. The Vitality fans certainly agree. They haven't stopped chanting since the end of the last game. There's no point point in slowing things down, Jorby. You can understand that there were a lot of moments where Vitality looked great. Zen, can he recover? Solo play opportunity. He dribbled it all the way down the other side previously. That's been the bread and butter for Vitality. More specifically, Zen. Couldn't even find the bump on Exotic, who has avoided those attempts from Vitality expertly. Vitality, they're trying to match K-Corp in that physical game. When it comes down to who's going to avoid those bumps, shot too light, too far. Radosnik clears it out. K Corp starting to press already. Radosnik sees a way out. Big clear. Immediately within the first minute, you've denied Vitality. Or excuse me, you've denied. Oh, Zen. Okay, Zen. He's back. 
He's back, baby. A big win from Zen here on the 50. Atachi completely lost the ball. k Corp full faith. Atachi was getting back to that. I was just about to say they denied Vatira, and they've allowed Zen to throw himself forward. Vitality, they didn't want to take the time out. They've got full confidence in that young prodigy. K Corp don't waste any time. Pass gets them in the orange half. Tira, last man back, Redosa forces the 50. Zen, Zen seeing the way out. Forward. Hard ball, Itachi gets it back out to the backside. Zen cutting it back to the corner, trying to force it across. Does he find his man? No. Always that last man back for Carmine Corp. Comes back, taking the ball away. Looks like they've taken the chains off of Zen, letting him flow in this rotation. He got the bump on the third man. There's space in the air for Redosa. Follow up opportunity. Good 50 out of out 54, and Zen's up again. Got the first catch. Breeze is exotic. Exotic kick, trying to touch. Now Radosin with control. Underneath Itachi. Radosin, saved by Matira. Not quite over. Exotic needs a clear. Itachi going to find it for him instead. Into the corner of Vitality. Can't get the read on the sidewall. KC, their back's against the wall. Alpha trying to catch it. Exotic not going to give him the space. Zen, reset. Zen, moving forward. Can't find the follow-up touch. Back to the midfield. Matira can't steal boost. Vitality done such a great job of retaining it themselves. The midfield stolen from Rodosin. Surely this is going to be developing play, but what a defensive stance from KC. Another touch here. Downfield. Shots too light then. Over to Rodosin again. K Corp crashing it. It's exotic. So aggressive in this rotation. He will not let Vitality get any free passes. But Vitality, they've hung on to that lead. They're not letting K Corp build that pressure. They're able to get those clears, and Zen is a monster in the front it of the It doesn't look like he's in his head at all. It doesn't matter about the own goal. This man continuing forward in every rotation, bullying Carmine Corp. He's getting demos, stealing boost, being aggressive. That's the role you want him to fit in. And here he is alone on the defensive side. Gives it right back to Exotic. Chance, oh. double tap. Missed. Zen denied by Vatira. Radostin. Oh, got. Itachi got Redosin to bite, but Redosin responds with a nice follow-up. On the stealing, Alpha tries to take it himself, but a heavy touch, he can't get back to it. Every time Vitality get in this half of KC, they're taking boost, stealing so much of the fuel from Carmine, and it means that offense is going to be that much more flat. Here comes Vitality, Alpha 54, through the corner, can't get the read. It's a stalemate. Redosin, he goes early for the read, and he gets it, Redosin. Reading him way early. Now Zen, some space. Reset. Zen, two steps, but not enough. Alpha just sends it. Zen in front on the dunk. Alpha gonna take some boost. The boost Radosin gets deleted on the side. Alpha loses the ball at K Corp. They relieve the pressure. But they keep some possession. Oh! The Itachi, the hustle to the ball. Got a shot on target. Still denied. Team Vitality stay in the lead. Itachi protects the retreat, and now K Corp of refuel. But Radosin, another massive clear. Oh, that's not on target. There was a slow opening Zen. Looks like Casey are fighting fire with fire, getting physical oh! themselves. Big miss in the midfield. That was a tight one. He tried to read that pass just a little early to get by the defense. Zen on the way, but Itachi keeps denying him. Dostin, everything is getting denied on both sides. Matira, flip reset, 50-50 in favor of Alpha. One team. They can't break through. Oh, but this could be it, Zen. He's hustling. He's got the break. He's got a player behind him. He just goes for the boost. Freezes exotic, but Dostin blocks. Zen up in the air. He's got a free ball. Alpha behind him. Atachi gets the free touch now. Exotic coming up. Whifty, whifty. No touch. And Radosa gets the ball. A reset. A drop ball. Zen not going to go. Vatira jumps early. Everyone's getting him the bite on the fake. The mind games are coming into play. No time left for K Corp. Getting downfield. Exotic. Be it. Oh, the one. Did oh, I come in? Oh, come in. Oh, 54 Radosin combining efforts and that ball will hit the ground. Vitality. Match point. It's a dog fight here. Vitality winning in the trenches. Zen getting his hands dirty. Staying in the front of the rotation. Opening up the gaps. And Carmine Corp. This time, they are the ones who just got denied. They had offense, they had opportunities. 
But then they started biting on the fakes. The fake challenges, they were catching them up. You saw the big one where Viteria, you thought he had the clear. Zen pulls it's off the on the challenge. Goal. Oh, so good. The first goal. After making that mistake, I can't get over it. I, I, I couldn't believe it. No timeout for Vitality. And we're immediately shown why Zen has been handling the nerves, dealing the, with the pressure off the backboard solo attempt. And that's the first goal we get out of the game. What a statement from the young prodigy. And his team, him, Farah, they've all worked to get to this point. They are one game away, Turtles, from getting to another grand final, their fifth consecutive. But you can't forget about Carmine Corp. Their journey so far has been a difficult one, but they've battled through every team they face. The winter major champs up against the spring major champs to make it into the grand finals. We're on match point for the first time in the series. Atachi gets over one. Atachi, he has been so good at protecting the retreat for K-Corp, keeping them alive on defense. Can he do enough to get them going more on offense? Kazira picks up a demo, but the shots are coming towards their net. Exotic also stuffing them. So many opportunities for Team Vitality have actually started in the midfield. They haven't been able to hold the ball in the corner specifically because of Itachi and the work he's been putting in. Or Vatira. They start in the midfield. It could be dangerous. Alpha 54, of course, he's got it red. Exotic. Protects the rock, creates some space. You see Vitality. They're, they're standing the first man, no matter what. I don't care if you're taking the ball back. I'm full boost diving at you. You better be perfect. It feels more risky from Team Vitality. Carmine Corp. Oh! You don't want to show your hand. Fake the shot and let the monster out. We talked earlier that Zen had been shut down for a couple of minutes. We haven't really said Vatira's name in a couple of minutes either. Vitality have taken control. They have the first goal. They have the match in their hands. It's been a defense first game, but k -Corp, they're lurking closely after all the talk about offense versus defense. What's gonna win some of the championship? How about this kid Zen, but Vatira finally gets if over there's it. one person you want to step up, it's this man behind the ball. Vatira oh! over to Itachi, shot denied. The shot's gotta be better than that for K-Corp. You can't just hit it right into Vitality. They gotta, you make them work for it. But K-Corp, here they go again, they're not done. Oh, up on the catch, Vatira. Starting to get mechy now. A little bit of space creating it. Exotic stuffing him. No transition for Vitality. redosin has got to work. It feels so necessary. Somebody has to show up. It has been Vatira as of late, even in this series. The second game for KC, he had Whoa! a ridiculous performance. Shot to the right side. Radosin finds the save. A lot of pressure for Team Vitality. Oh! The ball out of the play. And he touches it. Sends it home. And you can't Zen got smacked all the way back to France. And a tied up game we got. Matira has the beast awoken here with a goal for K Corp. The K Corp side is alive. Matira against Zen. He's still got the 50. He's still got 70. But two fatality members to beat. He can't do it. Exotic can't get back to his touch. Ten crashes in front. Radosin picks up that midfield boost, but K-Corp win the midfield. This is the first time in quite a while that Vitality have to take more risks on the offensive side. It looked like they wanted to cruise ahead on match point with that one goal lead. 
But now they gotta start sending a couple of more players forward. Vitaly are happy to let Zen start an air dribble from his own box. Confident they can grab that read they have every time. Zen still beating their first defender though. All it takes is another bump from either team. We either end the match or we go to Champions Field. No follow up, Itachi's there. This is where they can start something that could end the game. Here is Itachi over to Vatira who's waiting for Dosin. Oh. Now the follow up is not in time and it bounces up for Alpha. He's got another touch, Alpha, but Vatira ran right away. Here's Ben up high. Takes it up, Zen across. Oh. Oh. extend their lead. Insurance would be huge for Vitality. This might be the end of the series. Oh, Match point. It's wide open. It's a wide open shot. He Spin. missed it. He it. Alpha 54 with the follow-up. The champion. The insurance. The Vitality fans can feel it. 35 seconds. Got it up in the air. K-Corp, they need a miracle now. Two goals in 30 seconds. We've seen crazier things happen before, but not under this pressure, Torby. Exotic trying to get up for Alpha. This might be a chance for Itachi. He can't force the 50. Fatir was playing close, and now they've lost the ball. A demo. There's no time on the clock. They need a goal with time left. Got to be it. Fatira's gonna try. It's gotta He's be up Fatira. in the chest. Fatira forcing it. No shot can come. Six seconds to go. 